Hey everybody, welcome back or welcome to Something Old, Something New Car Rips. I'm Lance and I hope life's treating you well. Today we're doing the NFL Decadence Rip where I rip a football cards from the 2020s, 2010s, 2000s, 1990s, and 1980s. Crazy when you think about it, it's five decades where the cards there. Plus we have a pack. Hope we do the other 70s cards. We'll show you. So from the 2020s, I got the 2022 Classics. From the 2010s, I got the 2016 Contenders. I got 2006 Tops. Some 91 from the 90s. 89 Pro Set. I got some repacked wax. Hoping to get something from the 70s. And then we got a nice grab bag I found at the LCS. I had a Cooper Cup on there. Uh, each one of these has an autograph or a relic card in there. You usually have some nice cards in there. And then, as usual, I like to go back in time when I do these. Hopefully, we'll find some in the 70s. Every time we've opened up one of the repacked wax, I think we've gotten a pack from this, something from the 70s. So let's, let's go ahead and start off with our grab bag first, because I'm pretty sure I already have that Cooper Cub, but couldn't pass that up. See, you know, I, actually, I've been seeing his him on the cover of these grab bags a little more often than before, but uh, actually, I passed one up. They had another one that was the... Uh, one of the draft picks during. So there's the Eric Kendricks that was on the back there. And there's the nice Cooper Cup. Let's see, we got it. So some 2022 Prism in here. Larry Tunsil, Devonte Adams, Stephen Gilmore. Some baseball. That's weird. That's the very first time that's happened. Not sure what happened there. Jamal Williams, some more Prism. The Dillian Thomason. And our. It's not a bad one. Logan Hall. Out of uh, 99, 66 out of 99. This year's. Not really sure how he did. But that is pretty cool. Some more Prism. Well, some, at least some football there. Denzel Ward, Tyreek Hill. There's an Allen Robinson. Hopefully he plays better where he goes. Especially since I picked up a lot of stuff after he got traded to the Rams. There's a Matthew Stafford for the PC. And a Larry Fitzgerald. Jamal Charles. That's an older one. Is that 2015 Bowman? Yeah, some Bowman U. Xavier Hutchinson. Trace and Potts. Marvin Mims. Vermont Davis. And a Jamar Gibbs. That Gibbs was the highest draft pick out of there. If I'm not mistaken. But not too bad. That's a pretty good pack. So here we go. 2022 Classics. Hopefully we get a nice hit or a nice low number parallel. Something cool in here. Starting off with a TJ Watt. Jonathan Taylor. There's a Carson Wentz. Mean Joe Green. That's a cool card. Did you know Joe worked as a scout for nine years? There's a DeAndre Swift. And there's a Joe Montana Yellow. 77 out of 99. Jonathan Ogden, and a Devin Lloyd rookie card. That was a pretty cool pack. Move some stuff around a little bit here. Moving on to the 2016 Contenders. I'm pretty sure that the autographs were about the same back then as they are now, so pretty good autograph chance in here. I'm not sure what the autograph checklist was in 2016, but we'll see if we hit one. Steve Smith Sr., Sam Bradford, Odell Beckham Jr., Brandon Marshall, Devontae Booker, Rookie of the Year, and it's a Panini Gridiron, so a couple of, oh, we need to pick something out of there. Dang, that was a not a very good pack, but I guess that was a contender's pack. I guess we'll put Odell Beckham Jr. up there because it's probably the best out of there, and that's not saying much. We'll see how he does with the Ravens this year. Moving on to 2006. This is a hobby pack. It's a little bit better. Maybe a chance of hitting an autograph out of here. Roscoe Parrish. There's a Zach Thomas. Eli Manning. Not too bad. There's his third year card. Darren Sproles. Dan Morgan. Randy McMichael. Terrence Holt. Rookies. Bobby Carpenter. Antonio Camarotti. Said that wrong. And a Patrick Ramsey. Not much in there, I guess. Uh, we'll put the Eli up there. 
Moving on, the 1991 Flare Ultra. I don't think there's any big rookies in 91 Flare Ultra. There's a nice one on the back, though. Chris Everett, I'm mean, a Jim Everett. Tommy Kane, Mark Carrier, Don Majkowski. There's a Wade Wilson. Dalton Hilliard. Herman Moore, that's a nice one. Lawrence LT, that's another nice one. Charles Haley, another nice And Emma Smith. Clay Matthews, man, this thing is just loaded with Hall of Famers. And a nice Jim ever for the PC. Oh, man, I want to put that one up there, but you got to put the Herman Moore up there. That guy had a great career. Just moving on. 89 Pro Set. This is the Series 1. We have been open to some of the Series 2 packs, too. And we have not hit any of the rookies they were looking for. Super Bowl 7. Dolphins and Redskins. Chris Miller, QB. Dan Henning, coach. Leo Irwin. There's a Rams card. There's a Bruce Matthews. Lomas Brown. Man, those cards are way off. Look how far off center that one is. There's a Phil Sims. A little better center. Dexter Manley. Steve McMichael. And Jim Mora. So still nothing going on much in there. Let's see. We put the Bruce Matthews up there. I guess so. Get the old Houston Oilers up uniforms. Here we go. Repacked wax. Hopefully we find something nice in there. At least something from the 70s. Maybe even earlier. You know, I've opened quite a bit of this and I haven't found... I could probably... Uh, the 50s and 60s probably count on one hand how many of those cards I've pulled out. So... Obviously, some of the stuff from the 50s is uh, not the uh, traditional size, so it wouldn't be able to fit in here anyway. So here we go. Trent Richardson, a top strata. Leslie O'Neill hitters. There's a Steve Nelson, Patriots linebacker. Don't remember him at all. Played there for a while, though. There's an 85, Rolf. Looks like he should be a kicker, but... Oh, he is a kicker. No, I'm not sure what he's doing there, though. <laughs> Looks like he's catching the ball. There, nice one. Bo knows yardage. Bo knows. There we go. Tony Frisch. Oh, there we go. We did get something from the 50s. Dick DeShane. That's a cool-looking card, too. In uniform in there. College Nun. It looks like, oh, you can see which pirate was a grid star at Indiana U. And you, Ted Kluzinski says right there. So that's not too bad. I think that's uh, 58 tops. We'll definitely take that, though. I think that's, like I said, the first one we got. And then we did get some from the 70s. 73 there. Or no, 79. I always get those two confused. Jimbo Elrod. Nice. Something from the 70s. Something from the 50s. J.P. Losman. There's an Eric Turner rookie card. <laughs> Another one. Bob Avellini. Kyle Rudolph. Leonard Fournette. A checklist. And another Bruce Matthews. So there you go. I guess I'll go ahead and stick with those of the top five or tick top card from each decade. Uh, nice too. We got a couple cards from the 70s and a card from the 50s. So can't be too, too, too disappointed with that. We got a nice number Joe Montana. Let me know if you agree with the top cards or what you would have put in the top cards from each decade. As always, thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. Have a great rest of your day. And I'll catch you next time.